Bigfoot's creeping ahead. End of first, the first heat. End of the first heat. What's the matter here? What's the matter? God, he came here. He's got a helmet on and the engine. He jumped a gun on our battalion. He jumped a gun on my battalion. Bigfoot will be the official winner of the first heat. Sergeant Slaughter, are your men ready? All right. Jim Kramer, start your engine, please. Scorekeepers! Go! Here we go! You better pull! Whoa! He fell out! Wait a minute! 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 What's going on here? What's going on here? Hey, three seconds to go, two seconds to go. The officials will give this particular heat to the battle battalion. Everybody get ready, get ready to go for the final heat. Scoreboards are set. All right, now let's make sure that the sergeant is gonna take part in this one. Are you ready? Jim Kramer, you are ready. Scorekeeper! Here we go! Final lead! Final time! Those are gonna be 15 seconds to go! 13 seconds! Whoa! Back and forth! Those are gonna be 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1! That's it! That's it! The contest is over! The determination of the third heat is that that was a draw. That was a draw. Now, here's how the contest is going to be cited. You, all of you here in the Coliseum, will be the deciding factor of tonight's contest. First of all, how many think that the winner of the event was Bigfoot! How many of you feel that the winner of the contest was Sergeant Slaughter? battles to come, especially in the face of new technology. Like the latest advancement, half monster, half tank, a hundred percent tough. Hang on, let's watch two of the best of this new breed square off. Bill Town's Virginia Beach Beast, the first tank truck ever built, powered by a supercharged Chevy engine and driven by Mike Katz. And the car killer, driven by Butch Lowe, an M4 tank with an 86 Ford Ranger body. The Battle of the Monster Tank Trucks. Holy, Holy cow, cow, are you ready, ready, ready for this, this folks? folks? Well, well, get ready, get ready. here they come. come. It's a Virginia, Virginia Beach Beast against Car killer. killer. 30, 30 tons, tons of roaring power. power. Get, out get out of the way, way. they're backing, backing up, up to the starting, starting line. line. Hold, Hold on, on, I got, I got the, the sleds, sleds hooked up. up. And there's a the flag! They're coming off the line! Beast is holding ahead! It's digging in ahead and straight for the line! The Beast is there first! This is part of the battle now. They're unhooking the weight transfer machines for the second part of the battle. The car crash. Look at these things! You say you're tired of being tied up in traffic jams on the freeway? Well, we've got something for you here, folks. And as soon as you got the sleds off, they're off! Tanks are headed for the first pile of cars. Holy Toledo, look at this! The car killer's up and over. And there goes the beast. The car killer's pulling ahead. The beast is right on his tail. The car killer takes the next pile of cars. The beast is fighting to keep up, but he's too late. The car killer wins it. Fantastic! Look at these machines. Bob Chandler, big Fitzgerald, standing over there shaking his head. He can't believe it. Looks like.
like the crowd can't believe it either. What do you think, folks? Would you like to see the winner go against Bigfoot? You would! Bob Chandler's giving me a dirty look. Come on, Bob, you like the challenge? Let's see, the first time ever battle between a crack vehicle and a monster truck. Car killer versus Bigfoot. Here comes Bigfoot. He's not in any hurry to get to it. Want to take the challenge? Folks are seeing history in the making. The first time a monster truck has ever taken on a half tank, half truck. Look on Bob Chandler's face, it could be the last time too. Why me, he seems to be asking. Now Bigfoot is backing up the line. Hold on, this could be destroyed here today. Let's see what happens. Our killer seems to be having a little problem. We just got word from the track officials that his reverse gear has gone out. He can't back up. Looks like they're going to have to bring the sled to him. Whoa, this could be a real problem for Car Killer when it comes time to unhook the sled. How's he going to back up enough to unhook? He's going to try it. He is going to try it. Bob Chandler says this is not really fair. He's not sure he wants to go up against these tanks. So it's going to be the undefeated champion, Bigfoot, taking on his toughest contender, a half tank, half truck. 18 tons of genuine army tank threads. The original M4 threads designed to roll over anything this way. Powered by 57 cubic inch Ford engine with a C6 Ford ventilator, putting out 800 horsepower. Can you believe it? Bigfoot's owner, Bob Chandler, can't believe it. I mean, these things are great for invading holes, he says. But he doesn't like the odds of racing against one. Okay, we're making the final preparations here. They're hooking up the sleds. Looks like they're almost ready. And here we go. And they're off! Bigfoot shoots ahead. Way in the lead. Goes to the end. Trying to hook, unhook the sled now. Now they're trying to hook the sled with the car killer. Okay, it's let's go. There they go. They're changing lanes. Bigfoot roars over. Here comes the car killer. He goes wide. It's Bigfoot in the lead. It's Bigfoot all the way. Bigfoot still on feet. Bigfoot saves the day for now. But history is made at every U.S. Hot Rod Association show where you'll see the machines that are big, bad, and blown.